Hey y'all, welcome to my channel. So today we're going to do a weekly vlog. I know y'all love the weekly vlog, so let's get into the weekly vlog. But before we get into the weekly vlog, woo, I'm going to show you guys my pizza that I got from Nasty Gal. Shout out to Nasty Gal for sponsoring this video. Before we get into that though, so make sure you guys hit the subscribe button, turn your post notifications on, follow your own Instagram, you know all that good stuff. And let's get into what I got from Nasty Gal, because it's kind of cute. I got some vacation pieces. Okay, I got some casual pieces. I got a little mix of everything, so let's get into it. Okay, so first, as you can see, like, <laughs> this shirt right here. The reason I really like Nasty Guys is because they have very, like, little edgy pieces and, like, things that you just won't see on other websites. Like, they kind of have the guts to drop a t-shirt that says this. You know what I mean? I kind of like that. I like how edgy they are, so... I like this t-shirt it's in this nude color i got this in a size medium i could have got a size large for it to be like oversized but you know medium fits um and you know what it says clearly period all right let me pan y'all down so y'all can see these sweatpants and yeah they're pretty much like the same color as the t-shirt but they have little like mauve tie-dye these are really cute something super comfortable to walk around the house in or you can even run errands with a cute little white top and still be looking like nice and trendy and stuff so yeah this fit is definitely a lounge around the house fit but still kind of cute still kind of sending a message just in case you need to go out also have another little like casual t-shirt i really was in need of some casual t-shirts and they have some really cute ones so i had to get some this one says happy mind happy life and like with some cute little colorful graphics but still in like this dark very casual color and i felt like this was cute again lounge around the house or you can do like some denim shorts and some strappy heels and go right on out like i feel like that would be so cute a chill but like i'm gonna pop out outfit you know so yeah i like this one there's nothing on the back i believe let me see what size i got this in i think i got it in oh it's a medium so it must be like an oversized fit so i would say stick with your normal size if you um kind of want an oversized fit if you want a slimmer fit size down of course if you want an even bigger fit size up but i feel like this one fits good nice and slouchy and airy and comfortable all right so here is the next set super cute definitely like vacation vibes for sure or like a little all white party or something um but it's very thin so i would just wear it as a cover-up honestly and just have my bathing suit under i did get this in a size six i probably should have got a size eight just to make sure the pants were like extra flowy and not like tight right here and then flowy at the bottom you know what i mean um and also the waistband is very secure okay it is very snatching so it is definitely like sucking me in right here um but yeah i like this this was like just a regular shirt and then i just unbuttoned it and then tied it right here but you could tie these shirts any type of way you need to like you go on youtube you go on tiktok find out a million ways to tie a t-shirt well not a t-shirt but a shirt and they got you you can just figure out all different ways and it is kind of like a crinkly material. I don't know if you guys can see. So, I don't know. I just like the way that it looks. Here's how the pants look. Again, just like a flare type of pants. And they are nice and long, if you can see. All right, next is this top that I got from Nasty Gal as well. I kind of didn't know about this top. I don't know. I just kind of got it to see how it would fit on me and, like, how it would look. I'm not really sure how I feel about it. I think paired with a nice pair of jeans and like a cute little straw bag or something like that like it could definitely serve a look but just trying it on like with these pants set up oh look at the back oh okay anyways um i did not know it went up that high i didn't even look in the mirror but yeah i feel like paired with the right stuff it would be cute but yeah i'm gonna have to style it and y'all probably see how i style it up but <laughs> woo like it's giving feminine, it's giving sexy. Hold on, okay, maybe I do like this. All right, next is this top, and it's like this satin, like, lacy, lingerie type of top. And I like it. It's definitely more date night, or maybe even going out with your girls. Like, I like to look real good when I go with my girls. I don't know what it is. This paired with some black jeans, I feel like, will make it more nighttime. It'll kind of make it a little more sexy. See, like i don't know i feel like this with black jeans will really just go off so i really do like this i do wish i went up a size i think i wish i went up a size i don't know because it fits really good everywhere else here's how the back looks but i feel like in this area i just want a little more coverage either way it's definitely cute very like dainty sexy i feel like this would definitely be a hit if you style it correctly like i said i probably wear black jeans and maybe 
I don't know what kind of bag. Maybe even like a little pop of color, like a red. Ooh, a red would be cute. Ooh, red heels. Ooh, that would be cute. Okay, this next dress right here is a banger. I love it. Um, I'm a sucker for a white dress, honestly. Like, I just love white. I don't know, it just looks so good. So, it's like this stretch red dress. The material on this is amazing. Like, it's a very thick ribbed dress. So, if you're looking for a good quality dress, definitely pick this one up. And then look at the back. The back is out. Ooh. Um, I feel like that just adds to the sexiness of it. It adds a little character. And I just love it. It fits amazing. I'll pay you guys down to show you how long it is. Now, the only thing I do wish that the neck was a little tighter. Like, I don't know if you guys can see, but this is a little loose. Like, I would personally tailor it and, like, just take it in. You could honestly do this yourself. Um, but I would just take it in just a little bit just so it fits the neck but don't take away from getting it on here's how long it is it is a midi dress i know i love a good midi dress because it just fit good to make your body look amazing all right the next couple things i'm actually not gonna try on i'll tell you why once i show them to you all right so first thing is this two-piece set almost dropped it um it is so cute y'all i just can't fit it i'm so upset so the skirt i tried it on and my hips was like <laughs> try again you they were literally laughing at me like you knew daggone what that was not gonna fit you so i can't fit it but it is so cute i put a picture over here and it also has this little top right here which you just slip on kind of like a bandeau top and it has little ties to go around your neck like so and i just think it's so cute it's like a whole little rouge to like vacation-y like really cute set i just can't fit it and i'm really upset but that's okay because one day i will be able to fit it so you know next up is this really cute cover up i just know i just know the beach is waiting on me in this cover up it is so pretty um clearly it is a little see-through so that's why i'm not gonna try it on um but it is definitely super cute i'm gonna pop up pictures of stuff that i don't try on so yeah really cute it is mesh and then the back goes down a little further so you know it gives a little femininity a little sexy i love this it's so cute and it is long sleeve but it's very like airy and open so you won't be too hot in it next up is a bikini so nasty guys have been having some really 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 cute bikinis two pieces like all that type of stuff so definitely go check them out but i this one just it really just popped out to me like look at this color the color combo so it is a triangle bikini and it wraps multiple times around and i just oh i just know that's gonna be so cute and the bottoms are the same like color florally combo i really love this it's so pretty and i already know it's gonna make my like tan or skin tone just really pop i feel like this will look so good on so many different skin tones and you just tie it on the sides here mine isn't tied but you get the gist next up are these flats that i got from nasty guy as well and these are so popular y'all so i had to try them out they're kind of like a little platform um flip-flop and these were in style so long ago but you know everything is coming back in style so i had to get me some and just test it out and i feel like they're super cute a casual little fit um and you could just wear like some denim shorts with this a nice little oversized t-shirt a nice big bag and be like super like effortless but still cute you know like running errands but i look bomb lastly are these right here y'all these are so cute i love the color i love everything about them the way the heel is placed so i'm gonna get into the details but really quick if you see a shoe where the heel is kind of not right here on the edge but it's kind of in like this that means they're going to be so much more comfortable i have shoes that have the heel more inward like this and they're way more comfortable way more comfortable than shoes that come straight down right here i don't know what it is but get your shoe like this that's why everyone loves those um bottega heels because the heel is right in the middle and everyone says they're so comfortable just because of that heel girl so these right here they look so expensive to me in my opinion i feel like the leather is not too shiny like they just look good y'all and the um strap on the heel it's like stiff so it just kind of sits on your ankle <laughs> 
Y'all, just wait till, I, wait till I wear these. Wait till I wear these, okay? I actually saw these on someone's Instagram story and they were telling everybody to go get them and how they loved them, how they were comfortable. And that person had a lot of followers. I don't remember who it was, but I remember because they had a lot of followers. And I was like, thank you, because I already had these on the way from Nasty Gal. So I was like, yes, I like they didn't sell out before I got them. So cute. And I just love the color, like everything about them. They can do summer, they can do fall. Like these bad boys can do anything. So yeah, super excited about these. If they are still in stock, hopefully they are. I'll link them down below. That is all I got from Nasty Gal. Hope you guys enjoyed. Everything will be linked down below, including a coupon code for you guys to save some money off your order. Again, thank you to Nasty Gal for sponsoring this video and keeping your girl in the cutest stuff, like them shoes, that bathing suit, this dress. Ooh, let me know your favorite down below. Anyways, let's go ahead and get into the weekly vlog. Hey y'all, about to go get my nails done. It is what's today wednesday it's wednesday and i'm about to get my nails done i need to do some laundry though while i am girl looking bright um i'm about to do a load of laundry oh i forgot to tell y'all when i ordered my like women's wear jumpsuit it smelled like somebody sprayed perfume on it so yeah that perfume stinks and yeah it's like smell out my whole freaking closet so girl i'm about to do laundry like i don't even have enough clothes to do laundry but i don't even care like i cannot stand that smell it's like literally getting more intense by the day and i just cannot do it but in better news again i'm about to get my nails done and i gave her creative freedom so i told her just to freestyle my nails so we, we gonna see what your girl gets because i'm a little scared um i think i'm gonna be using some nail polishes that i actually have so you guys know i use the nail addict la gel nail polishes so i'm pretty sure i'm gonna be using these two colors the paradise fiesta this one is year of beauty and this one is called naked and famous so i think i'm gonna be using these for my nails i need to go find some flowers oh my gosh i'm really trying to like yellow my life out right now i don't know my hair keeps getting caught like in my nails because some of them are lifting and stuff but um yeah i'm really i'm really excited to see what she came up with so yeah i'm gonna see y'all when i go get my nails done but i've been paranoid like for the past couple days because i'm like oh my god what my nails really look like like i don't know i like surprises but also i don't so why did i set myself up like this i have no clue <laughs> All right, y'all, just came back from getting my nails done. Here's how they look. So cute. I asked her for like a 70s vibe because she's been doing this like really cool 70s vibe lately. So yeah, went and got that. I love them. The shape is amazing. So definitely check her out if you haven't already. I'll um, put all her information down below. I'm trying to get my phone to cut back on. If you know me, then you know my phone is always dying. <laughs> I've been trying to do better, but girl, today just wasn't it. All right, y'all, I'm back home. I got a package. I don't know what it is, but we're about to open it. I really don't know. Well, I think I have an idea what this is. I think it's a water bottle, but like, why is the box so big? Oh, uh, not a box inside of a box. I really hate that. Oh yeah, it's a water bottle. Just like I thought. So yeah, I got this big old water bottle from Amazon. It is by the brand Thermoflask. Of course, it is black because I just like black things. It has like the little straw thing right here oh it has two different straws in it. comes with another straw a little something something and i think this is um like it has like the two walls or whatever <laughs> i don't know really what it's called but i got this because y'all i need to drink more water and i feel like i just can never remember to drink water so if i just have this near me i'll remember to you know what i mean because my water bottles are like away so yeah i don't know i feel like this will just help me drink more water so i just got it my hair is like all poofy and stuff because it was very humid Ooh, because it was about to rain y'all know when your nails are like freshly done they're like super sharp i feel like i'm just scratching and beating myself up but um i'm uploading a video right now trying to get it up at least by tomorrow so you guys can have a new video because i definitely skipped I skipped the upload day and y'all in my DMs like, girl, when's the next time you're uploading? Like, what's up? Where you at? So, um, yeah, I'm trying to get it sent to the brand. 
but my wi-fi is so trash especially with just like larger files see two hours and 12 minutes left like what the hell before when i had um verizon for my internet and stuff everything uploaded is super fast as soon as i come here they're like oh no we don't like service verizon here like you have to use um xfinity so i'm like okay cool whatever xfinity is cheaper too no like i had to upgrade my wi-fi for my videos to upload like faster and even still they take hours like it's actually ridiculous for the amount that i pay and i'm not trying to upgrade no more i'm really just like after this year i might just be out of here sis because i cannot do this like i literally cannot work efficiently with slow ass wi-fi like it's cool for the rest of the stuff like you know just browsing on the internet and stuff but like working with large files for youtube you need some really good Wi-Fi, y'all, okay? Or else your video is going to take forever to upload this. So, if you can get Verizon, I recommend Verizon. I don't recommend nothing else. Verizon is that girl. Now, my hair just suffered so bad just being outside when it was, like, super humid because it was about to rain. So, I feel like my hair is just, like, super poofy. No good anymore. So, ponytail for the next couple days, clearly, because, like, look at this. It looks like I just blow dried it. That's it. Like that looks crazy. Hey y'all, I just got Starbucks and a sandwich. Ooh. Um, once again, crazy morning, so I did not have time to um cook anything. Whoa. As usual, my Thursday routine, I'm going to that outlet that furniture outlet to see if they have any coffee tables um or any dressers all right y'all let me go in here and see what they have i'll probably film like a little bit on my phone if they have anything but girl if they don't have nothing i will see y'all right back at home text from the um little mail room thing like the little app or whatever and they were like oh you have a package in the mail room i'm like bet i think i know what it is like cool whatever blah, blah blah i go down there and do my little stuff to like get into the mail room or whatever it say oh you have five packages five packages like what did i order what whoa like what happened all these daggone packages five packages of clothes y'all so yeah i need to open all of those and put them away kind of organize them in my closet and stuff if you watch my influencer life then you know how i organize my closet when i get like new things into um you know like work with like clothing like sponsorships i'm also waiting for one of my videos to be approved so i can put it up i'm really praying that they approve it by today because i really 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 want to put this up right now okay so let's make dinner i'm actually about to make my like shrimp pasta that i always be making um i think it was like one of the first meals that i showed y'all like on a vlog i think that was one of the first so i got my shrimp here and then also this is a sauce that i use it's called primal kitchen it's non-dairy it's gluten-free it's like all that good stuff 
I'm about to cut up all my vegetables. So honestly, for the vegetables, like I literally just put anything that I have in here. So I'm doing an onion. I have some peppers. I also have, don't roll away, Chuck. <laughs> I also have broccoli, which I had no clue that I had that, but let's use that. So later on, I do put like spinach and tomatoes in there. I put the spinach in after because, um, you know, I don't want it to be like too wilted and just like mushy. I this is my dinner just pasta vegetables and seafood some shrimp y'all know i love me some good seafood so yeah i'm about to eat this this time i do not have any wine oh, i wish i had wine with this because it would be so good with um this pasta so i'm kind of running out of space already again which is really bad because i just gave away like so much um so many clothes i kind of cleared out this whole top section i got rid of so much up here like i don't even know if i could see like it's pretty much like cleared out like all this used to be like sweatpants and stuff and i just cleared it out because i'm like what's the point in having like a bunch of sweatpants and like sweatshirts and they don't match with anything like i was telling myself that i really need to only have sweatsuits like things that will match together with each other i just felt like that would make the most sense on what to keep because you can wear it together you can wear it separate you know what i mean like you kind of have two outfits in one whereas if you just have some sweatpants that don't match with anything it's like okay girl what are we gonna do with this because my goal is to kind of have things that i could just throw on super easy super quick even if i'm just running errands like i don't want to have to try to match together you know a random top with some sweatpants like no let me just get some daggone sweatsuits matching sweatsuits that i can throw on run out whatever have you so this stuff is kind of new but i'm gonna put it right here for right now because i really want to organize my haul video so i really want to make sure that i have all of my stuff that i have for hauls right here so that i know what i need to be filming with what i don't need to be filming with like this stuff over here is basically my already put away section and then back here as well is like my jeans and stuff so i don't really need to worry about that i need to film with this stuff and then i have all these free hangers to organize you know all of the other stuff that I just got in, which is like five bags of clothes, girl. Why do I have five bags of clothes? Your girl's getting to this bag. But damn, she ain't got no closet space. <laughs> you guys will see all this stuff in upcoming like hauls and stuff like that. So I'm not really gonna say where stuff is from just yet. But this is kind of cute. Can't wait to wear this. I definitely want a um two bedroom for my next apartment. Well, I'm hoping I can find a two bedroom for a reasonable price because girl, if you know <laughs> living in a DMV like the cost of living is just absolutely ridiculous um so i'm trying to figure out if i want to spend like damn near four thousand dollars just to live in a two-bedroom like it's really it's really ridiculous i mean i'm sure i can find something that's like not four thousand dollars but you know what i mean like that's honestly in my opinion the average like the the amount that you're gonna spend all like all together like all your bills all that I swear to God, it's probably gonna be like a good 4,000. Like for all that girl, I might as well just give me a daggone house. But then that's like a whole nother responsibility in itself. Like I don't really know what I wanna do, but 
I honestly know I don't want to live here next year, to be honest. I know that sounds crazy. Like, I'm switching already, but girl, I can't do it. Y'all probably like, dang, you want to move already? Like, what's going on? And it's nothing, like, too serious that I would just, like, break my lease over. But it is definitely kind of frustrating that I have to leave my house to work. Like, why do I have to do that? You know what I mean? Like, I've been telling y'all, they only service... um comcast or xfinity or whatever the hell you want to call it girl they should call it non-cast because it don't be cast and nothing okay the wi-fi is trash so i need to move somewhere that has verizon honestly like i have had verizon for my whole life and i feel like i just need verizon and that's also another reason why like i'm so late on video sometimes because they take forever to upload so when i send it to a brand it's like often just not on time it's after hours because like it's just ridiculous, honestly. Absolutely ridiculous. Everything else about the apartment though, I really do like, like I'm not even mad at it. The people are so, 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 so nice. The, like the building is so pretty, so amazing. The apartment is beautiful. It's literally just that. And I may seem like, being, like I'm being dramatic, but once this is your job, then you'll understand. Hey y'all, it's Friday. I just got done working. I just filmed a haul video. Um, I feel like my makeup looks so off because I ran out of one of my concealers. So I think I'm going to go to um, Ulta and pick that up. But girl, we can't do nothing until I eat because I mean all day. Like it's real sad, real sad over here. I actually need to go grocery shopping tomorrow morning for some stuff for the um, cookout on Sunday. I used to eat a veggie burger like every single day. I don't know what was wrong with me, but I used to eat them joints every single day for like a snack for breakfast like i ate a veggie burger with my eggs in the morning like i was just obsessed i don't know why like it was just the weirdest thing ever it was like maybe a year ago or so but ever since then i ain't never had no veggie burger so we're gonna see if this bring like little flashbacks back but hopefully not and this water bottle has definitely been helping me drink more water i feel like when something has a straw i drink it quicker don't know why but um it just helps me drink it faster because it is like a bigger capacity and it's all like it's all just right here you know what i mean um i don't know what it is about just regular bottles of water but i never be doing oh i need to get more um water bottles i need to do so much i need to do so much y'all it's so like cloudy and just gray outside so i feel like i look super washed out or whatever but yeah i still managed to get some work done today so i feel very very productive i did not film anything for the vlog this morning because i got up sat here watched some youtube videos and then just got straight to work um, i'm about to go to costco i might as well just go anyways and um while i'm out there i can go to ulta because there's an ulta over there and get some more of my concealer because my makeup y'all probably can't tell but this is very like washed out lighting or whatever but my makeup look crazy okay hey y'all so i just got back from the mall i did not go to ulta or costco at all i actually just ended up going to the mall to just see what the mall had honestly um they have nothing also went to go try on a pair of shoes but they didn't have the shoes well in the size that i need they had the shoes but not in the size i needed because i'm going to order them online um but i'm going to try them on first i never bought those kind of shoes before they were a pair of um a pair of yeezys and I never had Yeezys before, so I'm like, let me go to this little hype store. I don't even know what it's called, but um, it's in the mall, and they have, like, all the, like, rare shoes or whatever. So, I went to go try them on, and they did not have my size. So, yeah, I went to go see if they had my size to try them on, because I already knew I was going to get them cheaper online than in that store, because they be taxing. So, girl, they did not even have, look at my little bun with my little pieces. <laughs> um but they did not have my size so i'm gonna just have to wing it y'all i asked the guy like how like what the sizing was on the shoe that i wanted so he gave me kind of like the size that i would usually that i would need so i'm gonna just buy those online and when they come i'll show y'all 
So I got something else for the channel. I love the brand new one. That's where my ring light is from. Those, that's where my other lights were from that I broke um, and I just never replaced. Okay, okay. So this is a tripod, another tripod. So this one just does 80 times more what the one I have now does. The one I have now is great for beginners for sure like it bends it folds it does all that but this joint right here be doing backflips it'll basically like pay your bills like this joint looks super elite this looks so cool like look at this oh my god and i love how i can fold up super small but i've seen it be like over six feet tall like i've just seen it do basically tricks you know what i'm saying like okay so yeah, I'm excited about that. Ooh, and I also went to Mom's Organic and I got me a green juice. And I also got chocolate covered raisins and Sophie, he knows, but oh well. And then also I got my dairy-free cheese that I always get by the brand Daya or Daya, whatever the heck. And yeah, tomorrow I'm actually gonna do everything I said I was gonna do today. <laughs> I'm gonna do it tomorrow because I'm so tired. I think it's just the rain. Like the rain is really making me tired. So I think I'm just gonna chill on the couch for the rest of the day. Do do. Hey sister. Hi. It's Sunday. We are getting ready for the cookout. So <laughs> the cooking. Well, the cooking. All right. Bottles. <laughs> this is a grocery haul. Should I just put these over here? them in the freezer. That was your decoration. Why don't you open that? Well, I'm gonna open it at some point. Well, I mean, you hey. know, but yeah, that's your, it's your bottle. This is the one for us to drink, right? Yeah. And <laughs> we're gonna open this baby. Period. That baby for me. Y'all, look at this tequila. I actually saw this at a restaurant and he was saying how it was so good, but he was like, it's a, a hundred dollars a shot or something like that and i was like i know the bottle can be that expensive because you know restaurants be up charging so i went and got it myself and i'm gonna try it out maybe not today but it's just gonna look cute on my little bar cart for now but we got my favorite tequila this is my favorite one at the moment and then of course we found this at the grocery store the nice and prime cali rose it is, I guess, the rosé version of the Soup Dog wine, and it's so cute. It's like pink, so we wanted to try that. And then we also picked up these little ready-to-drink cocktails. I've seen these. I've heard people talk about them, but I've never tried them. So we're going to try them today. And we also got ooh, the mango one as well. So strawberry and mango. This will probably be good mixed. Yeah, that's not what I'm I can't believe people really take shots of Hennessy. I would never in my life. Like that. Oh, it just sounds so nice. <laughs> my bar cart is about to be full. Well, no, that don't even go. I'm sorry, Henny. You ain't gotta do her like that. She just don't match. Okay. <laughs> She's not meant for decoration. <laughs> she is meant for consumption. She just don't match. Don't treat her bad. I don't like that. Like she's so stepchild. That shit is nasty. Go. That was dumb. <laughs> that was ugly. No, we can't we can't go out like that. You gotta okay, I don't We like gotta come from either. farther out and then boom. But <laughs> <laughs> not like you're shooting a fucking gun. Come in closer. Ready? <laughs> Go. Yes. No. Here's the real cheers.
continue it because it's kind of like a three-day weekend but um yeah last night was fun i had the family over it's my first gathering at my place and it was really fun so you know i did my thing i'm a good host or whatever um also my sister she's still here she just went out for a second but she was talking about some girl i'm gonna get you lit i'm gonna do this guess who was the lit one her <laughs> that was fun and we're actually going to get some like lunch slash brunch in a couple hours it's like 9 30 a.m right now it's i'm washing um some towels and stuff so we can take a shower but yeah i did not take a shower last night i just literally like was a little you know a little tipsy so i went ahead and got right into bed also oh my gosh last night i swear to god my toe is like fractured my pinky toe at that and i was like you know i was lit for like a good little 20 minutes and then my brain was like hey guess what you hit your toe don't even remember when but you hit it and it hurts and as soon as I looked down I was like oh my god my toe is like purple I'm gonna put a picture right here it was like purple and then it just started throbbing so you know how like when you're not really paying attention to something or you don't even really notice it like you're not phased by it but as soon as you notice it that's when it starts hurting that's when it starts throbbing and having its own little heartbeat like oh my gosh my my toe was like just my toe was no good i'm like walking on my foot but i can't walk like on my pinky toe so i'm like if i'm this is my foot i'm kind of walking like this like using these using this side of my foot to support me <laughs> i don't know what i did last night but girl what like i really don't even remember hitting my toe and i remember everything from last night that's just like with bruises i have bruises on my legs that i have no clue where they're from not from last night but just in general like you never you ever just don't know what happened i know y'all know i know y'all feel me okay i know i'm not the only one we don't have a lighter and we need a lighter <laughs> so google said to take a piece of dry spaghetti put it against the stove and it's supposed to catch fire like a match. We gonna see. We gonna see. This is the end of it. This is the end of it. Like this? I guess. I'm so fucking scared. <laughs> that joint not working. It's not working. Is it because there's no gluten in this? Shut up. Maybe the gluten is what catches fire. Shut up. You never know. I'm going on my gluten-free spaghetti. I'm, I'm just saying. Did you Google it or did you read an article that said Google said that. I go <laughs> look, yo, I Googled it, bro. I was scrolling on Google. Oh, uh oh. Oh, it's working. Ah, girl. <laughs> no, it's burning onto the thing. Oh no, so it's not catching fire. No, it's just burning onto this bitch. See, it's like still there. We are at lunch and we are at the Lena's Oasis. I went to the full bloom. I think I said this. I went to the full bloom like two weeks ago. But this this is the other side. So this time I got the mushroom pizza. I don't remember what this is called. It's one of their mimosas or yeah, one of their mimosas. We got crab dip, calamari, and then a good old froze. And I got the blood orange lemonade. It was really, really good, clearly. <laughs> oh, this is strong.